There's a saying traded back and forth between boat captains that says there are two types of captains, those that have run aground and those who are gonna run aground. And if you spend any appreciable amount of time behind the wheel on a boat, that kind of bad luck is eventually gonna find you. There's no doubt about it. Now add into this the element of darkness and you magnify those chances to the power of 10. Until recently, really your only option when you're running at night is to either rely on your night vision, which is sketchy at best, or use a handheld or some type of a permanently mounted spotlight. And this presents a whole new set of challenges. Lighting a boat up or lighting the water up in front of you with a spotlight is gonna temporarily blind you from the light reflecting off the inside of your boat. And sure, you can see all the obstacles in front of you, but when you shut it off, you're basically night blind at that point. So it's not really the best option for running at dark, but until now, that's really been your only solution. This afternoon, we're gonna join a good friend of mine, Joe Paskoski, who just recently installed a Psyonix Nightwave, which is a brand new product from Psyonix, and he's added it to his new 240 Schaefer. Joe likes to do a lot of fishing in the river and in the backwater, even in the ocean, and stay until really late, and this involves a run back to his dock through very treacherous waters in complete darkness. And for Joe, the Psyonix Nightwave seems like it's gonna be a perfect solution to the navigation hazards that he's likely to encounter from the ocean to his dock safely. Okay, Joe, the difference between this Nightwave technology and the older stuff, the infrared stuff, is this is actually a CMOS sensor and that sensor is using any available ambient light it's not thermal it's not looking for heat any light in the environment whether it's light from a house or the, the, we've got a sliver of moon right here stars any kind of light that's like noise pollution light pollution here in the waterway is going to get magnified to make this screen look like we're running in daylight the simrad unit is going to be split where half of the screen is our plotter and our gps screen showing us where the markers are gonna be and all that, where we're supposed to be. But the other half is gonna be the night vision that's gonna illuminate any navigation hazards like a floating log, somebody swimming across the canal. I mean, anything, a broken off channel marker, all those kind of things that you're worried about hitting in the darkness, you're gonna be able to see on the other half of the screen. Now we're gonna dim that screen down so that we don't blind ourselves here and ruin our regular night vision. And this should be really cool. I mean, we've got an hour's run to get back you know, I'd say we stop and hit a couple more spots, but sure. I'm really excited to see how this thing's gonna work out for us. Now, Joe, you've been fishing these waters your entire life, and this is your first night using the night wave. Tell me about the difference between all the experiences in the past and what we just went through here, running some treacherous waters. So George, I've fished these waters for about 20 years, and you know, you know them pretty well, but that last hour before dark, typically panic sets in, you're trying to get back to the dock. We passed a lot of markers, there's, there's curves coming around, um, sandbars and such, and this just gives you a tremendous amount of confidence. I feel much more comfortable and confident getting home at night in the dark uh, after one time using it. And really, you know, fishing for me, but also getting the family on the boat, going to dinner. As you know, if the wife's happy with the boat, we're happy with the boat, and it just makes the whole experience much more pleasurable. Well, Joe, thanks so much for taking me out and showing me how this Nightwave works. And I think we're both equally impressed with the performance of this unit. I mean, I can say without a doubt that this is gonna be a change for you, you know, for the better in your boating experience at, at night. I mean, there's no Absolutely. doubt about it. Absolutely. And as a side note here, 
I'd point out that we could see so well in the dark while we we're running that I can easily see somebody getting a false sense of confidence and wanting to go 70 miles an hour in the intracoastal in the dark because you can see so well. And I'd point out that stuff comes up on you really fast and there's nothing like running up on an object at 70 even in the daytime too fast. And at night, you know, you're entering a whole different world of trouble. Now with that said, the night wave unit far exceeded my expectations and I am certain that this is gonna be a game changer for the small boat market, the inshore skiff market, small center consoles, even offshore boats. But this is a unit that's gonna be affordable to the common man. I mean, this is an everyday boater's visual aid to navigation in the dark that's definitely gonna improve your boating experience.